Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm so excited, I'm so excited for this video. You know why? Cause today's video is what's in my gym bag. And surprise, surprise, I have a Gymshark gym bag. Is that a surprise? Not really. Have you seen my Instagram? I just wanna share with you more of me. And I feel like this is a good way to do that. First off, let's see, let's see. So if it's leg day, then you'll find my barbell pad in here. I don't use this to squat, cause you know, just use my, use my little baby traps to hold the bar up. I use this for my, what are those called? I use this for my hip thrusts. And one day I thought that I could be cool and not, and do hip thrusts without the pad. This helps me stop feeling pain so that I can grow the booty. And I greatly appreciate it. <laughs> Next, we have resistance bands. We have the easy, the medium, and the hard. I used to chill a lot in the medium, but now your girl's moving over to the hard one. We don't use this one because we've graduated. If I'm doing like side steps or kickbacks or anything like that, if I kick back too high, then you know, rolls right up so probably gonna update these soon but these for now are in my gym bag the next item I'm going to show you is something that I've always needed but never knew that I needed these are barbell clips the gym that I currently go to has like three of them everyone's trying to use them all the time and I'm not trying to drop the weight off and like you know I'm just like I'm not trying to die while I'm bench pressing or while I'm squatting and have the weight fly off and then I fly this way because you know it's all uneven. So I decided it was time to invest in my own and short story, really, really it is a short story. I originally bought these two weeks ago in black and I think that I forgot them in the gym. I lost them after two gym sessions. So you know what I did? I went on to Amazon and I was like, you're gonna buy the brightest color and you're gonna write your name on it because we're not trying to lose another pair of these. So if I leave this pair in the gym, people are gonna know. Oh, Courtney, the weird girl who comes in here smiling all the time and filming herself. These are hers. This just turns my gym time into a great time. What else is in here? Ooh, have a Gymshark towel? They went out of stock on this towel like six months ago and I was so sad. You know why? Because on leg day, this is a mess. And you know, sometimes your girl wears makeup to the gym and I'm not trying to use a white towel and have like my makeup get all over my, hmm, just. Why do I wear makeup to the gym? Cause I like to, thank you. Another great staple, having a sweat towel in the gym. And what else do we have? We have a jump rope. It's good, good for jumping, good for your legs and, your, and the jumping. We've reached the crucial part of my gym bag experience. We have two items that go together. They are my headphones. I always carry at least two pairs of headphones in the gym for two reasons. One reason, one of these is always about to die because I'm horrible at charging things. If one's about to die, I have the other one. Equally important, AirPods are not the best for blocking out the surrounding noise, which I've noticed in my new gym. Got a lot of boys in there grunting and <clears throat> everywhere. So if I want to block it out, I wear my Beats. Little hack, Beats are great as a headband because I'll be, I'll have a high pony up, you know, sometimes. That's my like, that's the one I like to do the most. But I'll have all these little hairs flying where my Beats, whoop, slide it back. Wait, I'll show you. See, now I'm ready for the gym. With the AirPods, let me just, we'll just test these out for you. If you haven't tried AirPods yet and you're, you're wondering, are these gonna stay in my ear? Will they fall out? Or am I gonna lose them? The answer is, I'm not sure, but I can tell you my experience. I've run up to 10 miles with these headphones on. I do hit in these, I jump rope, I do box jumps in these. They've never just fallen out of my ear from my activity. However, what I have noticed is that if I barely bump your ear on something or like you go to move your hair or something, I don't know if it's just me, but they like fly out and then I have to spend 10 minutes trying to find where this thing flew out of. But I still, I really enjoy them. I have my, what is this, titanium? I have my titanium shaker cup. I've talked about this before in one of my other videos. I have a titanium one because the smell does not get stained in this one and it's just 
made my life so much easier. Such a great option because now my bottle doesn't smell, it's nice, it keeps it nice and cool when I go to the gym, it looks so nice and pretty. Also, got my water bottle with my Flagstaff sticker on it. Sometimes it's too cold. Like sometimes it's like too impressive how cold it is. Like I have a brain, eye, teeth freeze, everything's frozen. So sometimes I put a little less ice in it if I'm not trying to freeze my whole entire body. When I first bought this, the cap did not leak at all. Like at all. And now look it, look it. On my hand. So I carry this into the gym. I have some deodorant. I have this like irrational or maybe not irrational, I'm not sure fear that I always smell in the gym. I could put 10 layers of deodorant on, just walked into the gym, it's been 30 seconds, and I'm like, I smell. So I always have deodorant in my bag because I have a fear that I smell, even though I probably don't. I'm not sure though, who knows. I, mm. I have some tissues, but they're not for my tears. They're for my muscles' tears because they be crying in the gym when I work them out. <laughs> Is that a <laughs> That's not a bad joke. Uh -huh. You know, let me just set the stage for you. Sometimes you go into the gym, you're having a great workout, and maybe someone comes up to you because you're looking extra cute, because I know you all look super cute in the gym, especially when you're in your gym shark. <laughs> People coming up to you sometimes can be like a little distracting. So one day when I was feeling to my top limit, I went on Amazon and I purchased this shirt. A boyfriend is not required to wear this shirt, by the way. 100% not required. And some people might say, wow, girl, that's a little much. That's a little extra. That's a little passive aggressive. But let me tell you, when I'm in the gym working on myself, my mind, and my body, some of these boys can be a little aggressive. So I would say that this is just the level of aggression needed. This is just a nice way to get my message across and say, hey, maybe, maybe we rethink coming up to me right now or my fellow queens watching this. Maybe we just, we just give us a moment. We just give us a minute. We give us our time to enjoy our workout. And some of the little things that I have left in my front pocket. I have my gym chapstick and I have a little lotion in case my hands get dry. I always have gum because I go through like, I chew like three pieces, four pieces of gum in the gym, almost to the bottom. These are all in this small pocket, by the way. And I have hand sanitizer, because because I touched all the bars that everyone else touches, and then I, I want my hands to be clean, so I go into the locker room, I wash my hands, and then I extra hand sanitize, because that's everything that's in my gym bag. So I use the Gymshark gym bag. I've used this for probably, I think I've had this bag for like, at least a year and it has been so sturdy. It hasn't ripped, it hasn't torn. My one little, little tiny baby criticism about this is that sometimes the zipper gets stuck on this like padding on the inside right here. But that just might be because I've had it for a long time. But like that, it rarely happens and you could just like pull it out. It doesn't get stuck for like life like some other bags. And just that the gym shark, the shark is starting to come off. But that just, you know, happens when you use something for a long time so I really really like this bag it's the best one I've had so far it holds all of my things really nicely and yeah thank you so much everyone for joining me on what's in my gym bag I hope you like this video you can hit the like button if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and please, please, please leave a comment below letting me know what you want to see on my channel. It's still a brand new channel and I like to read what you guys want to see and I definitely take that into consideration when I'm planning out my next videos. And I hope you have a terrific day and a terrific week and I hope you keep smiling because there's always something to smile about in your life even if it doesn't seem like it right now. If you're in your hard time, if you're in your dark time right now, it's okay. You'll make it through it. I promise you'll make it through it. I just hope that you keep looking up. You keep Keep smiling because girl you got this and I'll see you next time.